okay, discomfort uh, and great suspicion returned about something, and I want to explain it. Now, we're right on track. We understand the year we're in. We're in we need seven years to get to 2031, but I have to ask a fundamental question that you will understand. And I was literally driven up against the wall with this question, and, and we've got to address it. We can't let it go. Could we get past ABIB 15? This is the 13th in Jerusalem. Could we? What would we believe if the first day of unleavened bread passed? Just wait and hope day after day and until when? I've long wrestled with the kind, the kind of delay God would be speaking of when he says, though it delay, wait for it. It will, it will not tarry. Then you're left with, wait a minute. The first chance this could possibly begin is IR1. Now, somebody's going, wait a minute, we got to keep the, 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 the Passover with Christ. I will come to that. The more I stared at 84 months, the more suspicious I became of any Passover date. I mean, I was so suspicious of ABIB 1, but I ran into some problems with ABIB 1. But in principle, are we learning that ABIB 1 was right, except like the prophets and the apostles? We just didn't have the right new moon. We had a new moon. But then I'm thinking that what, what swayed me back was, boy, we keep the Passover with Christ. We will address that. But... Let me say it one more time. The idea of IR1, or we could say, are you sure it's IR1? We're going to talk about that. Because it, based on what we know, it's impossible, it's impossible for the Father to come before IR1. That's May 8th. It's impossible. Or you just, you just train wrecked eternity. Or th we could say thousands <laughs> thousands of generations. You cannot have the Father here until I are one. May 8th. Something just under, you know, 18 days away. I, I could stop and say, wow, in a way, <laughs> this is becoming easy, easy to grasp. We're in harmony with the prophets and the apostles and Paul and, and, and just certain rudimentary facts about the way months work. IR1's a Wednesday, so it fits perfectly forever. Apparently, he said, you do it on IR1, not ABIB1, IR1. What a shadow, foreshadowing that is. Now, you know, the, the disciples and the prophets never connected this. I don't know why. It wasn't given to them. They didn't see. They, they didn't get suspicious of IR. Uh, 